Oh, I'm so excited for today's episode because we're going to be talking about my favorite music websites and favorite resources to get music from for your production. Now, these are the ones that I utilize. If you guys have any additional ones that you prefer to use, I'd love to read them in the comment section below. But without further ado, let's get into it. Music can really amp up your production quality without having to get big expensive gear. And I would actually recommend investing in better music than better gear to make your production better. With that being said, let's go into my list of resources which I love utilizing to getting music. Going from the free section to the more expensive and which one works best for you. Okay, my first website that I'm gonna bring up is Income Tech, which is this guy named Kevin McLeod. He has an incredible resource of music available on his website. Um, there's an amazing variety of different genres, different types of music. The biggest thing that you're gonna realize though when you're looking at free music is that it is, you are paying for what you're getting. And there are some incredible songs there that I've been using Income Tech for about five years now and I've been able to kind of grab the music that I've been needing for my project. It isn't the exact piece that you're gonna look for, but for free, it is an incredible resource that I would highly recommend using if you're just doing some simple videos that there is no budget on. The site has music organized from genre to mood to even tempo, and you can choose whether or not you want something quirky or funny, if it's instrumental. He even has a brief description of the vibe and feeling of the music on the side. So I would say if you're needing some music for free and you need a variety of different songs, that website is a great resource to utilize and have on your tool belt. Number two on my free music sites would be Free Music Archive. Now this is another really cool one. If you're wanting something a little bit more like, like antique phonograph music or something like a heavy metal rock band, this website is a lot more geared towards that specific tune. And now compared to Income Tech, Income Tech, Kevin McLeod definitely has a specific sound to all of his music. You can tell that he has composed it, but when it comes to Free Music Archive, that is a collection of different artists. So you're gonna have people who are in a punk rock band or an electronic band. So you're gonna be able to get more um, musicians with vocals. You're also gonna be able to get some weird experimental stuff that you can apply within your project. Number three on my free music sites, um, I've talked about it before, but freesound.org is another great website for music and sound effects. It's a collection like Free Music Archive. Only difference is when you're looking for music on this, it's gonna be more like sound effects and stuff and beats and, and metronome type hits. You're gonna have heartbeats. So if you're looking for more like specific stemmed audio, freesound.org is a really good resource for those kinds of things. So those are like the free ones. If you're like, oh, I need music, you go straight to there. That's how you can get that right away. If you have a little bit more time available to you and you're working off of a tight budget, I would highly recommend you contacting a musician friend of yours for your project. Let's say you're doing something like a film score and you need that applied to your project. You'd be so surprised on how many musicians are out there that wanna do music for your movies. It's like huge resources available to you. And even online, you can even search up on YouTube, find some composers, music that you like. If they don't have a big following, it might be just as easy as dropping them a line and trying to get them to do the music for you. Also, if you do have a little bit more money, support the industry, pay people. Everybody likes making a little bit of money. Okay, and now transitioning over to the paid section, let's say you're doing like a corporate video or something that actually has a budget to it and you wanna have a higher quality sound than something that is free. So for a paid website, one of my favorites out there is Premium Beat. Now that's where you're starting to get into a little bit more expensive route where songs are ranging from 40 to $60. Um, but you're gonna get a really high quality sound, really good music available to you. And similar to Income Tech, it's a lot better organized. So you can search by mood, genre, feel, and most popular section. You're gonna hear a lot of music that like mainstream commercials use because Everybody uses premium beat. Second on my list, let's say you have like, uh, maybe you have money but not enough money to, to put into something that's like $60. Another great website would be Audio Jungle and Audio Jungle has music ranging anywhere from 10 to 20 to $30 per song. So it's a little bit cheaper, actually half the price than premium beat. Um, the organization is a little bit crazier than, than premium beat. It's a little bit harder to find certain songs but if you have time to research and look for music, you're gonna find some equally as interesting and unique songs as something like Premium Beat would have for half the price. The Music Bed is a great website that has a variety of different songs that are very unique to your project, 
but they are a lot more expensive and can get extremely expensive depending on what your client is or depending on what your project is. So let's say you're doing something like a small wedding video and it's just being seen by one person. They have a licensing agreement, so if you're doing something for a small company or personal, you're paying around 50 to $60. If you're doing something for a big company or a massive production that's showing to thousands of people, you can go upwards of $2,000 plus per song. It really depends on your project and your audience. And finally on my list is this great website called epidemicsound.com. And if you've been watching this episode through the whole way through, you've been listening to the music from that site. It's a subscription-based website that caters to YouTubers and online videographers. If you're doing something like a video blog or a YouTube series, this is a really great resource. You pay $15 a month for under 500,000 subscribers um, and beyond that I think it goes up to maybe $30 a month for like a million subscribers it's a really great website that has a great selection of music that you can categorize from genre mood feel beats per minute um, and I've been using it for the last like couple weeks now I highly recommend you take a look at all the websites that I talked about today give yourself an hour and just listen to all the music all the different vibes I have them all in the description below so you guys can take a look at them. They're categorized from free to paid to subscription based and um, listen to the sounds and you can kind of get a flavor of what you like what genre of music caters to you perfectly, and what value is in your price range. That is it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please give me a subscribe, like, and give me a comment if you wanna see some video or tutorial on something. I'd love to talk about it. Um, again, thank you so much for watching. I will catch you guys in the next video.